Good morning guys. It is Monday and I'm heading back into my school. This is the last week before I start back. So I'm doing all the little details and just trying to get my classroom perfect before the kids come in. But out of the day, it's really warm so I'm wearing shorts, this little white bodycon, it's from Penny's, and then this oversized shirt with my black converse. I'm gonna head into school now. I'm not gonna do too much today, but I'm gonna go in and see where my classroom is at and then I will bring you along for the week, the last week of setting up before we're back in school. But I hope you guys enjoy. And yeah, let's go into my classroom. So I'm in my classroom. I'll show you guys how my classroom is looking. So all their books have been delivered, which I need to put over onto the shelf. And I also have folders for them. I don't know where I'm gonna put those. That's the job for today. I also got some stuff from Mr. Price. So I'll show you what I got and then I'll put that away. Helper of the day, Bulldog. I'm just gonna show you the little things that I got in Mr. Price. Um, I always go to Mr. Price at the start of the school year just to restock on stuff. So I got this little paper tray to keep my art paper tidy in the art press. So I'm gonna put that in there now. Also treated myself to this adorable little heart mug for my tea on my lunch. I got some more jellies for my jelly box. I also got these packet of jellies. If they get enough dojos, they win a packet of jellies. I got some more Velcro, cause I always stick their names on their tables using Velcro, but I do need to print their names out. I also got some magnetic things to stick things up on the board. I got some student of the week cards. And I also got some new stickers because I always use stickers for the books. I just think it's just nice. I got these skin tones pencils to try out. I've never had them before, but we do do a lot of coloring people and stuff. So I thought they would be handy. I treated myself to some colorful whiteboard markers that I'm going to use. I like the chunky ones, so I think they'll be good. I also got four packs of Twistables for their tables. I always give them Twistables at the start of the year for their pot in case they forget colors or something. I also got a new pencil pot. I always give a prize pencil pot to the table that gets the most amount of points in a week just as a reward. So I got this one. It's just like a little cutlery tray and I'm gonna put a hand eraser, some coloring pencils, colorful whiteboard markers and then the set of normal markers. So I then got two folders, one for my fortnightly plans and one for my yearly plans, which I'm not looking forward to doing. And then I got these dividers, one for each folder. And then lastly, I got this little whiteboard that I can bring around to small groups and work individually with students. And I thought this would be handy. That is my little Mr. Price haul. And I'm going to put all this stuff away now and start setting it up. Need your reaction is fight or fight. First sign of color, I run and fight. Good morning guys, it's day two of, well, it's actually day four of setting up my classroom. I'm gonna head in now. I forgot to take paper down off one of my notice boards for it to be changed, so I need to go in and do that. I also need to I change my desk, so I'm thinking of doing a little DIY project on this desk because it's kind of old. It was gonna be thrown out, but I think I might paint it and I don't know, I'll see, but basically, the desk that I had in my room, I just felt like it was too big. So this desk is actually smaller, so I'm gonna go try and spruce it up a little bit. But outfit of the day, started making more of an effort with my outfits of the day. So I was just dressing in tracks bottoms. So Levi shorts, this shirt is from Shein, and my red Converse. Love this little red heart. I love navy and white and red. So warm, that's why I'm still wearing shorts. But anyway, let's head into school. So this is the table that I'm talking about. It's my new desk. It's just narrower, so it doesn't take up as much room, which I prefer. And then I need to take the paper off this notice board because the new one is going to be going up there. So 
so my cam corner used to be there but it's not technically a corner so I think I'm going to move it to there because this is so cluttered as the library so I'm thinking of swapping them so I have it set up like this with the library their side but I think I'm going to put the readers for home in these boxes and then I might get a little rug for there make it more cozy don't mind my dog on the table she has no manners So this is how the library is looking at the moment. I want to get a rug for in front of it, but I think I'm going to get rid of this tree, but I have saved some petals. So I've taken a few of the flowers off and I'm thinking of putting them around the cam corner just to make it more pretty looking. But don't worry, that tree isn't going in the bin. I think I'm going to give it to the secretary to put as you come in the front door of the school. I think she has an idea of what she wants to do with it. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm currently heating up my hot glue gun to glue some of the flowers around this border. Sorry, I haven't been chatting too much today, but I have changed my cam corner to a corner and it's just as you come in the door and also it's close to me so I can have a chat with them. I've got my little posters up there. Okay, so this is the after of my little cam corner. Just have the posters and then I added these flowers to the side. I think it looks sweet. I could add more, but I don't want to overdo it and I also don't want to ruin that tree. I think that's it for today. I'm gonna head home. I will be back maybe Thursday. I will continue showing you until it is complete. So stay tuned. It's a couple of days later, but I'm heading into school and I'm hoping it's gonna be the last day in school before school starts. I've got all my labels and stuff ready. So I'm going to hopefully get it all finished today. So let's go to the classroom. I'm just at school and my new chairs have arrived, but I'm just working on covering up my new notice board. So that's what I'm doing right now. New border is up. The new chairs for my classroom have arrived, so I'm gonna put them out now. I brought my rug for my bedroom at home into school and that's it in my library. I've painted my desk. It looks so much nicer. I'm just gonna put this on the top because it's all wrecked. My classroom is officially done. I'm gonna give you a little quick tour. So here's my desk. I've got all my little supplies that I need close by. I have some sheets ready for the first day back. School rules are the class rules ready. There's Bailey. This is my cam corner and that's our art wall. Here are all their books set up on the trolley. I've got my books in here. Whiteboard, interactive board, whiteboard. Then I've got all of my displays. I still have stuff to put up, but I don't put them up until we're doing them. And I've actually got five tables this year. Two second and three first class. Here's my little library at the back of the classroom. My affirmation mirror is still there. Amazing work still there. And the final thing I have to do is bring this down to the hall to get rid of it and put those in my car. That tree is going to the office and then this little station is gonna be a working progress. But yeah, that's the end of my classroom setup videos. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I will be doing some days in my life throughout the year if you want to follow along and yeah i also do them over on my tiktok if you want to check that out and i'll see you guys in my next video bye